This video goes over how to construct perpendicular lines in Geometer Sketchpad using the compass or circle tool and the straight edge segment tool. To start, you're going to press the fourth button down, which is the segment tool, and you're going to construct a segment by pressing down on one point and extending your segment out as long as you want and clicking again. Then you're going to press the second button down which is the point tool and you're going to create any point you wish. I'm going to stick mine right there. Then you're going to press the third button down which is the circle or compass tool and you're going to construct a circle starting at this point and extending past the line. You will notice that these two points of intersection are created. So we're going to use the point command or the second button down to create these two new points of intersection. Next we're going to create two new circles with our compass or circle tool starting with our endpoints that we just created as one center and ending at the other endpoint that we just created. And I'm going to do the same thing going back so the center of my circle will be this endpoint and I'm going to the other one. Next you're going to press the fourth button down which is the segment tool and you're going to click on one of the places where our two new circles that we just created intersect and you're going to extend your line to where the two circles intersect again. Next we're going to press the second button down which is the point tool and we're going to create this point where our two segments intersect. Next we're going to hide all of the additional pieces that we don't need. So we have our three circles we have this extra point and we have this other extra point which is the center of our small circle which we don't really need. So we're going to highlight each of those items and we're going to hide the, the objects. So we're going to go to display, hide objects or control H or command H depending on what type of machine you have. And we can verify that our new line is perpendicular by measuring the angle. So I can select each of these three points and I can go to measure angle and notice it shows us that the angle is 90 degrees. If you have Sketchpad 5, you can also show that it's a right angle by pressing this marker tool. Having your angle marker start at B, which is where the angle is, and extending it out. If it is a true 90 degree angle, it will show the perpendicular sign that was just created.